Welcome to quick fire extra time today. <laughs> Very quick fire. <laughs> How much more credibility does Jose Mourinho have now that we're seeing all this from Man U, Craig? Uh, Didn't Jose sign Fred? I'm Reggie. Sure. That, was, that, was that a Jose Ed. Mourinho signing? Well, it was Ed Woodward. They're all Ed Woodward signings, really, aren't they? Don't know. <laughs> Gap. Fed, fed up with the whole thing. <laughs> Look, he's got, he still has credibility. Doesn't take Solskjaer screwing things up. Um, uh, to, to, to go and change that, but equally, I think if Mourinho looks back and looks over his time and looks at some of the mistakes, uh, perhaps that he made while he was there, and he can fix those, he's still Jose Mourinho. He's still a tremendous, a tremendous manager who can have an impact at the right club with the right structure in place and with the right empathy, as he would oh, put it. empathy. Gab, can Lukaku honestly improve as a striker? He does better, and Inter likely don't lose against Juve. Yeah, of course he can improve. He's 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 a bright young man. He's got tremendous. Uh, uh, he's, he's a big dude. He's got tremendous physical skills. He scored a ton of goals in the Premier League on bad teams. I think the question is, uh, can Conte get him to to react quickly enough to to the way to the way Inter play with when they play those well, what Stuart Robson calls those uh, those blind uh, balls around the corner? Mm -hmm. uh, can he improve his chemistry with Lautaro Martinez? And I think the answer is yes, especially working with Conte. Whether that's enough to deliver a title, I don't know. Shaka, did Pochettino lose the team when he chose injured Kane over informed Lucas to start the Champions League final against Liverpool? No, I, I, I don't think you second guess that decision when you have a player like Harry Kane available to you. You play Harry Kane if he says he's, he's fit. Um, exactly where it's all gone wrong for, for Spurs, I'm not quite sure, but certainly. Players unsettled. Ericsson had his heart set on a move, and you're not quite sure what else has, you know, has been said with a lot of those players who were out of contract, negotiating new contracts. But it's, it's it's hard to correct. I'm not sure if this next question is tongue in cheek. Even without a Premier League goal, Pulisic gets an assist pretty much every time he touches the ball. How has he not replaced Villian as a starter yet? I'll leave that to Craig. Oh. I'll leave that to Craig to answer. This is becoming one of the most tedious, boring <laughs> subjects. He is not playing at Chelsea for the umpteenth time because Frank Lampard feels he has much better options at the moment who are actually playing particularly well. Tammy Abraham has not in his position but as a young man has started well. Mason Mount has got four Premier League goals in eight games. Hudson Odoi, who Bayern Munich wanted by the way, and we know he's super talented, has came back after a long-term injury. He likes him as well. Christian Pulisic, for the hundredth time in this week alone, is a very good player who's going to have to bide his time. All right. This is where Gab shouts as well, he's only 21! <laughs> There's the other side of the coin. I saw somebody put an argument up today. They say, well, che and I, I did some on digital in this earlier, is Chelsea signed him to be a superstar? No! No, no, exactly. no. So you don't get superstars for 50 million <laughs> plus. Superstars cost you these days five times that. Yep. He's not a superstar, right? And that's why he's on the bench. He's just a good young man with a chance to further his career down the line. But at the moment, Frank Lampard, and it's not a conspiracy against the whole of the United States, is because, he, and we're out of time because we need to go, he thinks he's got players that are doing a better job at the moment. Sticking with Chelsea, ask Craig if he feels stupid yet after all the things he said about Jorginho last season. What did I say about Jorginho? I, um, well, Robbo was very much against Jorginho, wasn't he? I don't remember what you said. I, I, I didn't... What, why, what's happened? I don't know. Well, Chelsea are going to win the league with him in midfield, I mean, they? correct me if I'm wrong, and Chelsea have been quite exciting to watch this season in patches, but... But they're still fifth. Yep. So, I... What? Of a very mediocre league. Final one, Shaq. What mm -hmm. kind of food are you eating during this diet and what will be the first thing you eat when the diet is over? Well, Shaq, is the, you're saying... Yeah. So, it's like, no greens, no alcohol. How did that go out this weekend? Good? Yeah. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Very good. No additives, no, no nothing. Right. Wow. And it's going all right, actually. I've kind of gotten used to it. Found a little rhythm. What's your mainstay? Hmm? What, what's your main... Like, no, well, the thing is, you could eat more stuff, right. but 
it's just got to be home prepared and you know no additives and no fast food type things. So it's all right. Lovely. And how's your hamstring? So it's, it's, not, it's been better. Yeah, you should see him walking today. He won't let me video him. <laughs> well, yeah, <laughs> I was see him walking I'll let him walk. I'll put my other hamstring Yeah, wait, wait. We're about out of time today, aren't we? Yeah, yeah. a longer extra Thank time tomorrow, goodness. maybe. We'll see. Uh, you can join us. Mark Ogden is here. Gab, I was always excited when Mark joins us. Uh, you're not here, Shaq? No, I'm not. Not tomorrow. Resting. I'm going to do my ham, rest my hamstring and rest work, in peace. work on my diet. <laughs> rest in peace. <laughs> Some way to end. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.